Hi all, welcome to another video of Nas Pharma. Today we will see the chapter Processing of Tablets from Pharmaceutics 1. These are important multiple choice questions from the chapter Processing of Tablets. So we will see the first question, question number one, the material used for film coating. The material used for the film coating. Options are hydroxypropyl cellulose, hydroxypropyl methyl cellulose, hydroxypropyl ethyl cellulose. So the first question is related to film coating of the tablet, the material used for the film coating. The options are given hydroxypropyl cellulose, hydroxypropyl methyl cellulose, hydroxypropyl ethyl cellulose and all of the above. The correct answer for this question is all of the above. These all three items are used for the film coating. Another one is enteric coating. Enteric coating is enteric coating. Enteric coating the material used is enteric coating. Cellulose acetate phthalate that is CAP. Cellulose acetate phthalate. This is the material which is used for the enteric coating. Enteric coating is mainly used for the drugs which has to be given this to ensure that the tablet should in disintegrate in the intestine. Enteric that is intestine. Tablet will disintegrate in the intestine, small intestine. That's why. The name enteric coating, this material used is cellulose acetate phthalate. Now we will move to the next question, question number 2. Effervescent tablet contain. Effervescent tablet contain. Options are citric acid, option B acetic acid, option C ascorbic acid and the last option formic acid. Effervescent tablet contain citric acid acetic acid, ascorbic acid, formic acid. The correct answer is citric acid. Citric acid is the correct answer. Citric acid is the correct answer. So what are the ingredients of uh, uh, this one, effervescent tablet? One is alkali bicarbonate, that is sodium bicarbonate like that. Alkali bicarbonate, bicarbonate, alkali bicarbonate. Second one is citric acid citric acid and the last one is tartaric acid these are the main three ingredients to prepare effervescent tablet along with that one medicament also will be there if suppose vitamin c effervescent tablet vitamin c all will be along with this one that is vitamin c is also known as ascorbic acid but here the question all the type of effervescent tablet contain so uh, it's uh, the most appropriate answer is citric acid that is this is the main ingredient plus medicament medicament if it is it depend upon the medicament which is using maybe this is calcium tablet calcium effervescent tablet that's osteocare one brand is there osteocare effervescent tablet so in that calcium will be there and vitamin c redoxon vitamin c effervescent tablet that is vitamin c along with this uh, bicarbonate citric acid and tartaric acid here the correct answer is citric acid now we will move to the next question question number three mixing of the ingredient for the tablet preparing should be done in mixing of ingredients for tablet preparing should be done in option a ascending order of their weight descending order of their weight option c no need of any order in one is to one composition the correct answer is they should be mixed in ascending order of their weight ascending order of their weight we will move to the next question, question number 4, most widely used method for preparing granules, most widely method used for granule, preparation of granule for the tablet is, options are dry granulation method, moist granulation method, preliminary compression method, none of the above, granulation, the granulation can be prepared by three method one is dry granulation granulation is a granulation process can be done with by 
three methods. One is dry granulation, another one moist granulation and preliminary compression method or slugging. Preliminary compression method is also known as slugging, slugging method, slugging method. So here the question is most widely used method that is moist granulation method is the most widely used method here this uh, disintegrating agents uh, all the agents powdered medicament along with other excipients are moisted with a sufficient quantity of granulating agent in this moist granulation method now we will move to the next question question number five which of the following is known as slugging method this is just now we discussed this is sluggy method options are dry granulation method moisture granulation method preliminary compression method none of the above the correct answer is preliminary compression method is also known as sluggy method next question question number six according to indian pharmacopoeia according to ip the shape of the tablet is defined as according to the ip if the question is coming like this that's what I am saying. IP according to the IP, the shape of the tablet is defined as options are circular with a flat surface, circular with a convex face, and uh, option C is spherical. Last option D circular with a flat or convex face. Indian pharmacopoeia defined tablet as the shape of the tablet as circular with a flat or convex face. That is option D is the correct answer. Next question, question number 7. Disintegration agent which melt at body temperature is. Disintegrating agent which melt at body temperature is. Options are sodium bicarbonate, maize starch, methyl cellulose. Last option, option D, coca butter. That is disintegrating agent which melts at body temperature. Disintegrating agents are classified into three ways. One is one by swelling disintegrating agents act according to their action mechanism action. One is by swelling by swelling. Another one is through producing effervescence by producing by effervescence production effervescence and the last option is um, body temperature melt the melt at body temperature these are the three mechanism for the action of disintegrating agent here the by swelling method potato starch maize starch here it is maize starch potato starch wheat starch methyl cellulose bentonite all will come under this one but maize starch is the cheapest and commonly used maize starch is here commonly used method by effervescence method by producing effervescence when they are contact with the moisture options are sodium carbonate sodium bicarbonate citric acid and tartaric acid the next one melted body temperature example is coca butter the correct answer here is coca butter that is disintegrating agent which melted body temperature is coca butter disintegrating agent acts through acts in three ways one by swelling one by effervescence production one melted body temperature here the question was melted body temperature example is coca butter by swelling example is May starts by effervescence example is sodium bicarbonate citric acid by that one tartaric acid. Next question, question number eight. Rotary tablet machine. Rotary tablet machine is it can produce about dash tablet per minute. For the production, single punch tablet machine is there, then rotary tablet machine is there, multi punch tablet machines are there. 3 then dry quota tablet machine 4 type of machines are there for the production of tablet one is single single punch tablet one is single punch single punch tablet machine another one is multiple multi punch multi punch 
multi punch tablet machine and the third option is rotary tablet machine rotary tablet machine then the fourth option is dicota tablet machine these are the different type of tablet machinery or the production of tablet here the option is question is rotary tablet rotary tablet machine can produce about dash tablet per minute option 1000 1200 then 500 and 5000 the correct answer is 1200 is the correct answer 1200 tablet per minute that is rotary tablet machine can produce next question question number nine the process of removal of material by the upper punch from the upper surface of the tablet this is coming under the uh, manufacture defect in the tablet so the removal of material by the upper punch from the upper surface of the tablet is known as option capping option b sticking option c picking option d mottling so in the in this one i think you know this one capping is partial or complete removal of up or bottom of the portion of the tablet partial or complete removal but up or bottom of the portion next one sticking 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 is the uh, material which sticks to the wall of the die in this material the tablet material for the production of a tablet when they are punching its uh, material is sticks to the wall of the die then the picking picking is the material is the removal or uh, picked up by the upper punch here the removal of the material by the upper punch from the upper surface is known as picking here the correct answer is option c picking mottling is the so we talked about this one mottling mottling is unequal color distribution unequal color distribution on the surface of the tablet capping i already discussed sticking and here the option the picking is the correct answer that is process of removal of material process of removal of the material by upper punch from the upper surface of the tablet is known as picking option number 10 unequal distribution of the color on the surface of the color tablet is known as this one now just we describe we talk capping sticking picking modeling the correct answer is modeling option d is the correct answer now we will move to the question number 11 quality control test for the tablet quality control test qc test for the tablet include friability test dissolution test shape of the tablet all of the above the correct answer is all of the above shape of the tablet dissolution tablet friability test next question question number 12 minimum number of tablet to be taken for the quality control test for active ingredient this question is you have to read the question very well minimum number it should be minimum the, the minimum number of the tablet to be taken for the quality control test of the active ingredient options are 20 10 5 2 correct answer is 5 but normally number of tablet taken for the QC is 20 normally generally taking is 20 but minimum is 5 less than 5 no minimum it should be 5 for the checking of the quality control for the active ingredient now we will move to the 13th question friabilator 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 revolves at 20 rpm, 25 rpm, 50 rpm, 55 rpm. So, Friabilator is working at 25 rpm. Correct. So, Friabilator is working. Friabilator is working at 25 rpm. So, in the one minute, 25 revolution is taking place in the Friabilator. So, thank you guys for watching this video. This is a very important questions. These are the very important questions and uh, you have to also study the ingredients means excipient. What are the excipient used in the production of tablet that is as a diluent. I will write it on here. You can hit symbol note for the diluent examples are for the diluent examples are lactose mainly lactose sucrose 
commonly used items mainly lactose lactose sucrose sodium chloride dextrose starch etc then the next one granulating agent granulating agent granulating agent used are water alcohol water alcohol then starch mucilage mucilage of starch starch mucilage then acacia mucilage acacia mucilage tragacan mucilage all are coming under this granulating agent next one is binding agent binding agent binding agent are gum acacia powder gum acacia powder gum acacia powder so gum acacia powder is a binding agent example for binding agent disintegrating agent we already discussed in one question then lubricants are coming lubricants examples are magnesium stearate talc calcium stearate all are example for uh, lubricants glidants also coming under the same category talc sodium chloride magnesium stearate are examples then adsorbing agent example is magnesium carbonate then colors flavors sweetening agents are used along with this one sweetening agents like sucrose lactose and mannitol are commonly used as sweetening agent so you had to study this one uh, for the sometime in the examination question paper okay, question will be coming like which of the following is used as a diluent which of the following is used as a disintegrating agent which is the following used as a lubricant so you had to study all these thing thank you very much for watching this video if you like this video please uh, make a thumbs up and also share with your pharmacy friends thank you